welcome back for another week of Learning Our Bones. So hopefully you guys have a wonderful break. This is our last week before our Christmas holiday break. Hope you guys enjoy it, being with your family. And um, just be safe, enjoy the holidays, and we'll see you guys back here in two weeks, okay? So let's go ahead and get started, all right? So let's see what we got here. Oh, this was the new bone we learned last week. Remember, it's your little tailbone right here. I told you it looks like a rattlesnake. It's a hard one, coccyx, and we're gonna put it right there. Oops. Oh, the other new bone that we learned, the long bone in our body. Femur, good job. Okay, pinky side, ulna, great job. Oh, our hip, right here. What do we call it? Pelvis. Two triangles on the back, scapula. All right, middle of our spine, right back here. I know it kind of looks like the ribs, but these bones right here, which vertebrae? Thoracic. Remember I tell you how many there are based on uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner? So this would be lunchtime. How many? 12. Yes, 12. Okay. Bone that protects our heart. Sternum. Oh, my favorite. Fingers, what do you call those? Phalanges. I like that word. All right. Skinny, bitty, skinny bone right here on our collar, clavicle. All right, long bones in our hands, metacarpals. Little bitty bones in our hands, carpals. All right, we said thumb, pinky side, now thumb side of our forearm, so it's this one. Radius, good job. All right, long bone in our, in our arm, humerus. Let's see what else we got here. All right, bones that protect our lungs, our ribs, top of our spine, cervical vertebrae, and how many? Remember breakfast time? Seven, seven in the morning. And then our lower spine, lumbar vertebrae, good job. And there are, it's dinner time, it's early dinner, five, okay, good job, five. All right, this bone here, mandible. Oh, and the two easy ones. Two hands on our head, skull, and everybody knows the top of our head is our cranium. All right, we got two new bones. All right, so let's start with the first one. So the first one, if I pull up my, um, my femur, if you look at this little bone right here, some people call it their kneecap. The real medical name is patella, okay? So that little bitty bone on your knee, it actually, it's actually a free-floating bone, and that means it can move around. It's a patella, okay? So that's our patella. So we're gonna put our femur back, patella. Now the next one that we have is this long bone right here in the front, okay? So it's right below your femur, all right? And this bone here, we call it our tibia. And people call it their shin, but its actual name is the tibia. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this here. And I just realized that my camera is a little bit too close. I'm gonna back it up so you guys can see. And then there is our tibia right here, okay? So patella and tibia. All right, Gators, thank you so much for joining again. I hope you guys are enjoying learning your bones. We are almost done, guys. We only have, if you can see, four bones left, and then we're going into our muscles. So again, have a Merry Christmas, and we'll see you guys later. Bye, take care, Gators.